you have a false sense of security. A knife is more dangerous than a gun. The survival rate of a pistol, not a rifle, but a pistol, or a revolver, pistol, the survival rate is higher if I get shot two or three times than if the guy had a knife. A knife is very, very dangerous. An old crippled lady with a kitchen knife that's crazy could kill me. All my training could be done. Okay? So, you don't want, until you get some level of skill fighting empty hand, you don't want to pretend that you can take a flayed knife out of someone's hand. Hey guys, Wolfman Combatives here, showing you some nice defense stuff dealing with a knife. is extremely difficult if you are not able to fight one-on-one -on -one in all ranges of combat, meaning MMA, plus headbutts, biting, eye gouging, and all the dirty stuff. If you're not comfortable with that, you're not going to be comfortable fighting multiple bear opponents or one guy with a knife. Very dangerous. A old lady with a kitchen knife could kill you. I'll be the, I'll be the attacker. The, the usual attacker just looks like this. Is someone just kind of like comes up, they hide the knife behind their leg, or, and they're kind of like, and, bah! and they swing the machine and stab you as many times as they can, four to 27 times, until you're bleeding and bleeding out on the street. So that's the reality of a street attack looks like this. It's just this, bah! and that sting is pumping into you over and over and over again. That is most knife attacks. Hey, whoa, chill out, man. Chill out. to him instead of my relationship being up here. If I didn't have the distance I'm closer and he's already in my face, maybe I got stupid and I stayed too tight instead of making my distance in a fence. And he starts to go back, I could go here. I could go for a punch and a jam. I'm coming in to follow his draw. So he's going for something, could be a pistol, could be a knife, and I'm gonna punch him here and I'm trying to jet in here. And hopefully I follow so he doesn't get the weapon out. It's half out, whatever, it falls to the ground. Uh, if he managed to start getting it out, go ahead, grab. And I went late, even here, boom. And now I'm hitting him over and over and over again. And I have my arm extended uh, to keep uh, it straight, to keep structure. I don't want it bent where he's stronger than me and he can pump it into me. I want to keep it out play and keep my weight going backwards. Okay? So, ideally, I want to punch and jam it and follow the draw before it's even.